Hi guys, Nebuks here, and I want you to show you my latest addition to my Minecraft world. The texture pack that I'm using, it's Summerfield, and uh, also I use uh, for the video recording the Sonic shaders. Also, from now on, when I'm making the videos, not all, I will uh, use uh, creative mode all my buildings are made in uh, survival but for the it's easier for me to make uh, a video using the creative you know you just take a look at like this it's way easier to make a, a video or uh, something like that to switch between uh, creative and uh, survival, I use uh, MC Edit, the latest version. But uh, let's talk about uh, the improvements that I've made in the in my world. First, at the monastery, I know that I said that said that I want to improve it, but uh, it. It, I needed to have more uh, reads, so I doubled the size of it. So right now I can uh, take from a full uh, harvest about uh, I can make uh, a full stack of books. Uh, books. It is very good, but the worst thing is that in 1.3. You, to make books you need also letter so right now I was working over the mountain hills in that uh, farm area farm complex I have added a cow factory it's mostly the same the same principle like my chicken factory also here I have uh, a wheat farm because cows need a big amount of it oh I forgot a dirt block so here we have the cows are, uh, I have two rooms of them this is the cooker the, the furnace where the cows come with, uh, on this uh, lava, uh, sorry, water tunnel and drop down in that uh, furnace. And after they just uh, remain on that uh, fence, so they, uh, they drop uh, only the items drop in that uh, water channel that all the items go here in my uh, control room this is the cow factory control room we have uh, pool to play the two rooms that I can clear and, uh, to clear also the, the crops also between the, the cow rooms I have uh, a gate so because uh, you can't uh, spawn the cows from eggs like chickens so you need to breed them so when I clear one uh, room the other one have some cows so it's uh, easier for me to to keep going so let's clear uh, the first uh, room I say You can see how it works. Oh, why the water doesn't drop? Oh, there's something odd. Oh. Sometimes I double click. And as you can see, the water drops. 
and clear all the, this room. I made a too wide uh, hole because with one uh, only one block uh, hole, it, it was very hard to to clear the the room. But in the future, I remove those uh, pistons and uh, make some uh, dispenser with a water bucket because in 1.3 uh, you can do that. It's, e it's easier and also I'll, I'll, I'll be able to remove the fences because first the cows uh, were swimming up and die in the, the water column. column. You can see the cows just happily drop down in that lava blade and uh, burn and I get uh, all my items right here you can see glitter, beef also when uh, the crops are full uh, wheat and seeds Let's close the room, open the gate, and you can see that uh, cows are uh, able to come uh, and fill the, the first room again. Just pump some more uh, wheat on them to make more of them, and uh, we can repeat the process. But enough for this farm. Let's move to the mining district, the taiga one. I think that I I remove that those buildings from that um, the first mining district and uh, just uh, make there uh, some kind of the castle and uh, all the necessary. Also, I forgot about. I made this uh, field. I, I tried to not uh, remove any blocks and all use the uh, terrain. And this uh, windmill, it was inspired. The blades were inspired by the assassin, but I like it. Very nice. But as I said, let's move to the mining district where I've made uh, another uh, another ice factory it's very fast it can be faster but uh, for me that that is just enough uh, I think that I removed those three wash towers because they're a bit ugly with uh, and make uh, some more this is the chicken factory also here I made three towers as per requirements from the city building challenge and this is the new ice factory I have uh, an infinite uh, water right under those, those uh, half slab, wooden uh, slabs and uh, let's say that I will use silk touch and uh, oh. and remove the ice You need to remove all the ice for it to work. Let's say that it's like this. Just clear it. And the, the something is wrong. Okay, never mind. But it works like this. I 
all this is because uh, this, this one is very slow to work because it only has one uh, one blocks that uh, that goes to ice here I've made a little fishing village but uh, I used the uh, silk touch on uh, mush mushrooms so I have those blocks but my best that I that I work on it this next next project I show you right now is this one this is will be my port it's a fortified village I just finished this uh, light I don't remember light tower or and this is the main uh, village here I have uh, the, some boats some some cranes some kinds of other buildings this one it's a barracks it has also a crane to take the goods upstairs it isn't finished yet, I still need to add some doors, some... something. Here I... is the party. A nice door. All the... plaza is, is made using upper half slabs, because I don't want the monster to spawn. Here I, I hate when monsters spawn. But uh, I always play on hard difficulty, so this is how I do this. This is a shop, a water mill right here, a windmill. I don't like it very much. May maybe the roof, but works fine uh, just now. Here I have the inn, a little church. Keep in mind it's still work in progress, so I need... Also, I, I don't have any more moss stones, so I still I need to make some working, some mining project, because I need that in my uh, buildings. Also, I'll try to add some redstone right here. Some maybe the porticles that goes up and down, mm -hmm. like the the one in the market district. Some lighting system. Some kind of servers. But, uh, until now, it's enough for this video. Thanks for watching, bye bye!